Every spring, in a ritual that seems as old as making hay, Owen Smith brings the carousel out of storage onto Brighton Beach. And with it, the Mockingbird, a standard 54 built in 1888. A Victorian mechanical organ of elaborate and exquisite design, the Mockingbird has provided the soundtrack to simple seaside pleasures for generations. An icon which defines a truly archetypal setting, its quietly timeless presence speaks of an elemental appetite for life. The scores for this relic of vernacular art from the Age of Empire consist of perforated cardboard books. The hand-cut holes in these activate the mockingbird's pipes, brass and assorted percussion pneumatically. The repertoire is modest, a collection of upbeat tunes from an era when home fires burned and troubles were packed in bags by laughing policemen. Though 130 years old, the Mockingbird is an instrument for which no music has yet been written. No original score has explored its expressive range or exploited its idiosyncrasies until now. The Carousel Commission proposes a grammar for this untried instrument that composers across the country can consult. And a new, collaborative, epic work for voice, school orchestra, strings and electronics in which the Mockingbird is both lead instrument and conductor. Its promise? To celebrate the age-old impulse for innovation and reawaken the automatic muse. Its legacy? New works that last forever and are heard by tens of thousands till they too become familiar as the birds at sunset and the rhythm of the waves. Mm -hmm.